Wait, this is not giving us anything. Oh! Oops. <laughs> Alright, hold up. We're not done, buddy. We're not done. Unfortunately, you also need an operation. And unfortunately for you, buddy, you are getting a heart surgery over here. Wait! No! Wasn't I supposed to do a, a surgery there? Did not dare to get caught, Sasquatch. Hey, I'm a doctor. Leave me alone. Yeah, you guys move. gotta move that out of the way. I don't have time. I don't have time for this. Alright, let's get another job going. Perfect. Come on, who's next? Uh, I'm burning up. Okay. Let me assess the situation here. So, if you're burning up, not seeing any problems with you, let me do a temperature test. Alright, so he has fever. Think. Let me add his details. Go. Nope. Uh, sh go with this one. Temperature information. It's not that bad though. Uh, fever. Give anti-inflammatory. Okay. Pretty easy mission. Hold on, buddy. Can I dress you up? There we go. Some of the missions are super super easy. Uh, C1. Hmm, I guess the burger would help up a little bit. There you go. You sure this is safe? It is, buddy. Alright, just 250. That's fine. Hopefully you can do a lot of missions today. I don't think I'm going to be able to finish it, though, because the missions are really not going that much, that fast. I just did something toxic. Oh, God. Uh, we got to do a toxicology test, then. Okay, let's go with the toxicology so we can find out what. And also, let's make it advanced to figure out exactly what it is. All right, you do that. There we go. Poisoning. Of course he's poisoned. Uh, which means I'm probably going to take something from the pharmacy and give him kind of like an antidote. But let me just put everything inside the data over here. Something toxic. Let's also put the data that we got from the toxicology, from the test results. Come on. Man, we need to operate our computers here. We got to make them faster. They got to be snappy. All right, poisoning and we need antidote. Of course. Easy, 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 easy. I knew that that's going to be something I need to do. As I was saying, the more of these missions you do, the uh, faster you start to learn what needs to be done. Uh, mm. Antidote, C1. No, grab it. There we go. There we go. 300. Come on, come on. We got this. I know we got this. Uh, I've got pains in my chest. Hmm. Pains in your chest means either x-ray or cardiology. Oh my god. So sorry about that, buddy. Okay, so the x-ray doesn't really give us anything. Okay, never mind. So I guess I gotta get him running a little bit here. This is probably gonna be heart problems. Wait, this is not giving us anything. What? Seriously? Oh! Oops. 
Um, oops. <laughs> um, oops. <laughs> I I, I kind of messed him up. I kind of messed him up. No. Hopefully I didn't break his leg or anything. Oh no, he's limping now. I broke him. I hate this. I hate this so much. Now I'm gonna have to have another problem I'm gonna have to fix, which means I'm gonna have to do the x-ray on his legs. Dang it. Oh, I don't like this at all. We messed up. I'm not happy about this. Not happy about this at all. I should not have gotten that guy to run that fast. Patient uh, is... No, of course he's limping now because it's my fault. Dang it. Uh, patient has heartburns. Uh, proton pump inhibitor from the pharmacy. What? Next area machine. Okay. Proton pump inhibitor and I got to do the x-ray on his leg. Now I got to fix him. Dang it. Yep. Oh my god, I broke his leg. No. Oh, that is so bad. So bad. All right, come on, buddy. Let me give you the proton pump incubator first. Uh, which is... Ooh, B2. I never gave this one to anybody so far. No, wait, don't shake his hand. Huh. This will really help with my heartburns. Thanks, Doc. Okay, buddy, hold up. I gotta fix your leg now. Unfortunately, I messed it up. I messed this up, and now I gotta fix you more. Man, I could have been done with this one so much faster. But I completely broke his leg there. I mean, look at that. His, his, his bone is fractured in two spots. Dang it. I think that's his left leg, right? Left leg, yeah. Oh, man. Alright, come on, buddy. Get over here. Uh, left leg is this one. Somewhere around here, you gotta do this operation. Man. Imagine you're going to the doctor in order to get yourself, I don't know, like some pills and you're leaving from the hospital with a broken leg <laughs> in an operation on your leg. I don't want to even imagine. Don't even want to imagine that. All right. Um... Hold up. We got to get him better. There we go. All right, buddy. You're fine now. Dr. Sasquatch is here to help you. There we go. Wait, what? I feel so much better. Zero. Of course, we got a zero. At least we got a little bit of the uh, upgrade going there, but we got a zero because we messed him up. We did malpractice. Uh, something feels off. I'm not sure what. Okay. Let's, uh, let's find out what. He definitely has an issue here. Yep, if you undress him, you can see his problem. Uh, okay, let me dress you up. You don't have to see this. Add the visual observation. I gotta make sure I don't mess up uh, patients anymore. Run a temperature test. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, that's blood test. Never mind. I guess we can run them both. Ooh, he's got an issue actually. Yeah, we definitely had to test that out as well. Let me also test the fever. Hmm, pretty high. Okay, let's go with this, 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 and add the test in. Skin rash and skin cream. Oh, seriously? Okay, I guess uh, I guess that's gonna be an easy one. 
come on, come on. And C2 for the skin cream, which is this one. Alright, crap. No, not the burger. Do not use the burger for your skin. Alright, perfect. That's been solved. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I want to do more tests. I have a feeling like something is like wrong, you know? Okay. Not sure what's wrong with this guy. But I gotta inspect him a little bit. What is wrong? There's nothing wrong with him. What? Um... I'm not sure what's wrong with him. Okay, let's do a little bit of this then. Let's take his pressure, his temperature. And figure out if... Oh god, yep, yep, yep. There's something wrong with him. Okay, okay. So his blood pressure is the issue. Uh, high pressure, blood pressure medication. Okay. We got blood pressure medication. Oh, which one though? I guess it's just A1, right? Yep. Yeah. Uh, how does it look? The red one. This one. You definitely don't want to give people the wrong pills because you are absolutely going to destroy them if you do. Alright. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Faster, faster, faster. We're doing them so fast. I have a feeling like something like wrong, you know? Oh, he's got a fever. Okay, uh that. Yeah, I'm seeing him sweat like crazy. So let's do that and temperature. Wait, he doesn't have a temperature. Seriously. What about the blood pressure then? Interesting, interesting. Visual observation. Patient is wedding. Yep. But why? The temperature and the blood pressure look okay. We didn't get a, a red on them, so I'm not quite sure exactly what's wrong with them. Because he doesn't seem to have a temperature or anything. I think I'm going to have to do some more tests, yeah. To figure it out. Uh, excessive sweating, prescription, deodorant. What? Are you kidding me right now? So is that really an issue? He has excessive uh, sweating and I gotta give deodorant. <laughs> what the heck, dude? Prescription deodorant A2. That is so funny. Wait, how does it look? <laughs> Am I seriously giving him deodorant? That is just so silly. Uh, okay. There you go, buddy. Huh? Never heard of this stuff before. Do you think it will help with my excessive sweating? <laughs> oh, that's so, so silly. Alright, we got another 250 here. We're getting closer to the promotion. Come on, come on. We got this. I don't know what's wrong, dog. Oh. Um, nothing wrong with you, apparently. So let's do a, pressure, a blood pressure here. That looks okay. That doesn't really look okay. 79. Actually, it's, it's okay, I guess. What if I do temperature? Nope. Temperature is okay as well. Hmm. Interesting. He has a rash? Oh, I didn't see the rash on the feet. Never mind. Never mind. Uh, I guess just a cream to uh, fix the rash might be what I need to do here. Right? Oh, hold up! I gotta, I gotta finish this now. Unfortunately, sometimes getting the temperature uh, does make you waste quite a couple of minutes. Uh, skin cream, yep. Okay. 
I don't haven't seen the skin rash though. Hold up. Oh, he does have a rash on the feet. Yeah, now I'm noticing. Never mind. And I think the scream is on uh, the, the cream is on C. This one. I remember I gave that one to a lot of people, so I know that that's the one that I need. There we go. Awesome. Hey, one more. One more, one more. Come on, we got this. One more, and we got this. I'm feeling like something, like something's wrong, you know? All right, let me check on you. Oh, God. Okay, so you got skin problems, which I already know what I got to do. We already know what we got to do here. We got to give him skin uh, cream, just like we did with the guy with the uh, feet rash. Yep, just a skin rash. Awesome. I'm guessing whenever they're getting that, they can either have skin rash or they have they can have something worse. Uh, which definitely means that you have to make sure you give them the right thing. Because if you just give them the skin rash, that is definitely not going to solve the problem. It's going to solve the problem on the exterior, which is the skin rash. But uh, it's not going to solve the problem on the interior, which is might be something uh, worse. Hey, there we go. Finally, we are about to be upgraded. Yes, 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 yes. All right, let's see. Hey, Dr. Santin, I heard you've been doing some fantastic work here around the hospital. Uh, how would you like a promotion? Congratulations, you are now the senior Dr. Stanton. It comes with a higher pay along with other great perks such as, you see the bed in the middle over there? No way I can sleep here. You can sleep in there whenever you want, free of charge. Let's keep that a secret just between you and me. I don't want the government to crack down on us again. Not after what happened last year. Oh, and you'll get a bonus for using the virtual doctor now. You should still use it if you want, but you don't have to. Just watch out for malpractice penalties. If you give the wrong treatment, those are expensive. Keep up the good work. Hey, there we go. We finally got upgraded. Which means what I can do right now is simply jump over here. Oh my god, we can actually rest in the hospital. No way. And early in the morning, we're waking up right over here, which means we can get straight into work. Are you kidding me, game? That is so cool. So, so cool. Unfortunately, we're not really getting something that I was really hoping to get, uh, which would be the ability to, I don't know, kind of like customize the hospital a little bit, maybe add like a uh, launch area for ourselves to be able to rest in. That would definitely be amazing. Let me just grab these ones real fast. But uh, now, as the senior doctor, I don't think we're going to be able to upgrade ourselves anymore, are we? Keep up the good work. What if I chat with this guy? Hey, Stanton, do you want to take over my shift? Yes, I want to. Uh, you know what? Let's try to do another one. Let's see if we're going to be able to keep on upgrading ourselves. I don't know. My stomach feels really upset. Okay, let's find out what's wrong with you. So if I use the uh, virtual doctor, you don't have to if you don't want to. That's what they're saying. But I definitely want to do it because that is going to give a bonus for the pay. So bonuses means more money. You are wasting time by doing this, of course. Uh, okay, we got to run the test. But that's fine. Let us run a test over here. Oh. Uh, I guess we're going to go with Toxology, and it's going to be an advanced one. That's fine. Come on, come on, come on. And of course, I could solve this one if I want to without using the machine. No problems, unfortunately. Okay. Another machine, actually. I can still solve the case maybe here without using the virtual doctor. But as they said, if you use it, you get a bonus. And I most definitely want to get myself a bonus. Bonus pays all the way. Uh, use this one here. The thing is, we haven't figured out what's wrong with him. So maybe he's just going to get like a simple thing for his stomach. Like just some pills to help with that. Uh, Antasio. Okay. Easy, easy. So what I can do is go in here. I was also hoping that I could go in and out out of this place without having to talk with that guy every time. Uh, B1. Just antacid. Antiacid, maybe? Is that what that is? For the stomach?
There we go. Oh, you can still keep on upgrading it? Seriously? Well, we got 350 for that. That is such a high pay. So, basically because we used the diagnostics lab, we got 50. Oh, man. I think we still have to use this. The jobs are still not done. Okay, well, um, let's keep her going then. I've got pains in my chest. Um, okay, buddy. Let's see why you got pains in your chest. So this could be a problem for the heart. Yeah, cardiology, okay. Let's see, if he doesn't have any heart issues, then we're probably gonna have to do a scan. Let me try to make sure I'm not gonna mess this up anymore because the last time I did it, I absolutely destroyed the patient. Okay, so we are seeing some issues over there. So these are definitely heart issues that he's got. All right, let's print it out. Ooh, severe. Oh, God. That's bad. That is bad, buddy. Let's see what we got to do here. So, we got some severe problems for him. Use this again. Add the ECG. Probably gonna have to give him some hard medications. All right, cholesterol test. Oh, seriously, just that? I could try to do all the tests just because we can. Yeah, we definitely can do that. So let's do all the tests here. It's gonna take a while because that's a lot of work that he has to do. So uh, let him do his thing. One thing that I really want to test, now that we can sleep inside this bed, can I fast travel this location to the hospital? Because if that's going to be a thing, I'm going to be super duper happy about it. Okay, his blood looks okay. I haven't got one of these situations where we had to check out the blood test ourselves in here to see if it's uh, something wrong with it. But I'm guessing once you're going to find issues with the blood test, that's when you're going to be able to actually see something wrong with uh, the telescope. Come on. Let me through. Let me through. And the issues are high cholesterol. Okay. All right. Probably gonna need some pills for the high cholesterol, but I'm still gonna use the, the machine because using the machine gives bonus. And we want all the bonuses we can get. Let's put all this inside. I'm pretty sure that if you do only one simple test for the lab, you're getting a small amount of money compared to if you're doing a lot of tests, like a larger test. All right, high cholesterol, uh, cholesterol pills. And blood pressure. Okay, okay, okay. Let's check the blood pressure first. Okay, so he does have issues with the blood. Uh, let's add this in here. Maybe I gotta give him high, cho high cholesterol medication and also blood pressure medication. Alright, uh, so we need blood pressure medication. Cholesterol pills and heart surgery. Oh God! What? Blood pressure and cholesterol, and then heart surgery as well. Jeez, this uh, this bill is gonna be pretty big. So we got cholesterol pills, which is B one and uh and A one, B one and A one. go. Yeah, I think I got what I need. Got these two boxes, so that's what your buddy wants. And next up, you got this one for you. Oh, there we go. That's good to know. All right, hold up. We're not done, buddy. We're not done. 
Unfortunately, you also need an operation. Nope. Operation room. Sorry about that. And unfortunately for you, buddy, you are getting a heart surgery over here. I don't see anything on their patient file about needing surgery. Wait! No! Wasn't I supposed to do a, a surgery there? No! Didn't that... Wasn't that what I was supposed to do? Oh my god, did I mess it up? I must have messed it up. No. 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 I'm pretty sure he said that I need to do a heart surgery. Oh, hold up, hold up, hold up. You'll get some stiff penalties for that. What? Oh, no. What do you mean, dude? I had to do surgery to him. Dang it. I messed up. No. Seriously, game? Well, that was a big, big mess up then. Oh! 775. So what the heck did I mess up then? Hold up. Let me get my paycheck here. Let's check. Unnecessary surgery. What? Oh my god, the paycheck would have been so big if uh, they would not have deducted those uh, 250. Dang it. Alright, gotta pay more attention then. Alright, let's keep it going. I've been eating terrible lately and I feel bad. Hmm. Maybe he got food intoxication? Yeah, I think I gotta go for the toxology test and see if uh, he's got poisoned. Alright, and the test is saying vitamin D deficiency. Okay. Alright, let's find out what I gotta do next. It's not the uh, one we gotta they give them food, it's something else. So let's find out what it is. Uh, grab this, put it here. Let the machine do its thing. I absolutely love it that they have this hospital update, but there's so different. Each job is so different. Uh, driving the ambulance is, of course, a little bit more entertaining because you got to go back and forth, back and forth. But in the hospital, you got to do a lot of uh, office work here. Give patient food high in vitamin D. What? I don't know what that is. What is vitamin D? Is it going to be burgers? Um... I don't have any vitamin D foods. What am I supposed to get vitamin D? Or... Oh god, police, police coming. No! No! Sasquatch! Did not dare to get caught, Sasquatch. Hey, I'm a doctor. Leave me alone. No. Dang it. And I love it that they're also kicking you when they're catching you. <laughs> you're not just fainting everywhere. You're just actually being absolutely destroyed, demolished by the police. And the thing is, we lost everything we stole. So we're going to have to go back to the supermarket. Patient, come on in. Come on in, guys. Uh, something's wrong with me, but I can't uh, put my finger on it. Hold up, buddy. Uh, first of all, I'm noticing that I do not have the fast running shoes on. Let's figure out what is happening with the patients. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything wrong with them, though. Hmm. Wait, why, why can I not add the comments of the patients? Something's wrong with me, but I can't put my finger on it. I mean, let me figure it out then. Uh, blood pressure seems to be okay. I don't think he has a fever. Because if he had a fever, he would have definitely told me about it. The thing is, we started today's schedule at only 1, uh, 2 p.m. because we got caught by the police. Oh man, not gonna be able to do too many uh, cholesterol tests, okay. 
Well, since he cannot put his finger on it, I'm going to do all the tests to make sure the bill is going to be as high as possible. Man, I'm such a mean doctor. Instead of just testing what I need to test here, I'm absolutely destroying this guy. I mean, he's not helping much, right? He says that he has no idea what's wrong with him, so I gotta find out. I gotta figure it out. Dude, can I please put this in his hand? There we go. Insulin, huh? If I only can't eat that stuff. Ah, uh, if I eat the whole thing, that's zero G of glucose, right? <laughs> oh man, please don't. Hey, 550. Is it because I give him a big bill, I wonder? Hold up. Yes, yeah, because the diagnostics lab, look at that. So if you do all the tests in the diagnostics lab, you got 250. Hmm, not bad. Not bad at all. Alright, uh, I'm gonna go to sleep. It is already very late. Out actually, hold up. What time is it? I actually, I think I can do another one. Uh, during my trip to the desert, I was bit by a rattlesnake. Ooh. Of course, for this one, you gotta give him anti-venom. But I just gotta add the uh, data here just to see if I'm gonna get the uh, update. As I was saying, I want the bonus. That's what I want. I really want the bonus. I'm also gonna chat with you. Let's activate the pharmacy here. But I'm 100% sure I'm gonna need to get the venom. Uh, antibiotics, anti inflammatory, anti acid, antidote, antidote, C1. Pretty sure I'm gonna need this. I'm 100% sure about it. Wait, what? Let me have a look at your bag. Hmm, you got a lot of stuff in there. Well, I trust you didn't take anything you weren't supposed to. I got my eyes on you. Wait, what? Am I not supposed to? Oh, she took it away from me. Okay, never mind. Uh, snake bite. Clothing time. Interesting. I guess you just gotta wait for knowing exactly what you gotta do before you can actually take some pills. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. You can really mess up if you're not paying attention. Snake bite, anti venom. I mean, isn't that what I got to give him? Isn't this anti venom? Hold up a minute. Is there something else? Oh, is that the antidote? The anti venom is. B2. Never mind. I don't even see the anti venom anymore to put it back. Oops, I think this is uh, gonna mess me up. Yeah, I think I messed up. I needed this instead. Dang it. I really messed up. Okay, we got 350, but I think I must have uh, messed up. Hold up, let's check. Actually, no, it's all good. Huh. Strange. Very strange. Well, in that case, let me get some sleep in. Oh, hold up. I cannot get sleep because we are super duper tired. Oh, God. This guy has radiation. Um, boom. Yeah, he's got radiation. That's the problem. Uh, use the x-ray machine to look for problems. Am I using X-ray again? Seriously, he's already X-rayed enough. No, I should not do this, dude. Why am I using the X-ray machine? I don't get it. He's already been X-rayed enough. Uh, perform an electrocardiogram. Okay. Man, so many says I gotta run on this guy. He seems okay. Why am I doing all these tests? I already know what this problem is. Yeah, he's all healthy.
All right, let's keep going. I guess uh, I I'm just increasing the bill here. Okay, let's add this in. There we go. Yeah, I gotta give him the X-ray antidote or whatever that is to fix him up there. Cholesterol tests. Okay, let's do all the tests. Why not? Uh, all of them. Let's pretend we don't know what this guy has. <laughs> oh, I'm the worst doctor ever. I'm the worst doctor ever because I know exactly what his problem is. Alright, buddy. Let's see. Anything wrong with you? Radiation poisoning. I knew it. I just knew it. I could have easily given him the uh, pills here. Alright, and we got anti-radiation, of course. Of course. As I was saying, I knew what I had to do. I just wanted to do it because this would give us extra stuff. All right, and the anti-radiation is... Wait, where is it? Oh, this one. A2. The black bottle. A2. All right, buddy, hold on. I'm, gonna I'm about to fix you here. I love that they can turn green. Hey, it's fixed. 750. Nice. Uh, hold on, buddy. I know I gotta know what's wrong with you. I just don't feel normal lately. Hmm. Uh, visual inspection. Ooh. Okay, we know what's wrong with you, buddy. Come on over. I need cream! Which is this thing. And the faster we get rid of him, we're gonna be able to give it to somebody else. Uh, give medication to somebody else. And get even more money, maybe. There we go. Easy. 450. There we go. Wait, so because I didn't use that machine, maybe now I got the upgrade? The update? Unassisted. Ah, okay, I get it. So basically, you're getting a bonus of 150 if you are not assisted by the machine. I get it. Ah, but you gotta pay attention because it comes with a risk. If you do it, uh, if you don't give the proper treatment, you are gonna get in trouble. I'm gonna try to do as many as possible without using the machine. Let's see. I've been eating terribly lately and I feel bad. Eating terribly lately and he feels bad. Um. I guess what I gotta do is a test. We gotta run a test here. And for the test, we gotta go for the cholesterol. Vitamins as well, maybe? Yeah, let's do that. Test complete. All right, perfect. Wait, deficiency D, right? I wasn't paying attention what that said. But I think it said deficiency D. Which means... What if I give him one of these? Probably because someone shoplifted all of them. 70% of my daily vitamin E. Hey, we did it without the machine. Look at that. Oh, so that is how you get more money. Yeah, look at that. Unassisted, 150. Nice. Okay, we're starting to be a, a better doctor here. Definitely starting to understand this better. I really want to try to solve this case without using the machine as well. I really want to try to become better at it. Uh, ooh, diabetes. So for diabetes, he needs insulin, right? All right, perfect. Uh, let's go in here. Uh, the insulin is... Which one? Insulin. C2. So this is insulin. And if I give him the insulin... Oh my god, 825. I think this is the best paid so far. And of course, it's also the bonus, right? I mean, look at that. We did it unassisted. We got the 
the lab, cardiology, and diabetes. That's why we got all of it. I, I guess if I would have also would have done like an x-ray, I could have gotten like 1,000s. Man, you can definitely scan them, uh, scam uh, your patients quite a lot here, eh? <laughs> Uh, my arm really hurts. Ooh. Uh, okay, I'm not noticing any issues with you. But if your arm really hurts, I'm gonna be guessing X-ray. Oh, it's a uh, broken. You got a fraction bone, buddy. That's why your arm hurts. All right, come on over. So, he's got a fractured bone. What this means is that... And it also hurts. Right? That's what he said. My arm really hurts. So, he needs painkillers. And he needs an operation. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna risk it. Uh, Anti-inflammatory pain relievers. B2. So let's give him one of these to help with the arm. Oh, what? What? No! What do you mean you call the cops on me? So first of all, they give you a warning and after that they call the cops? Wait, can I get the guy to slip? <laughs> oh my god, that was funny. Oh no, I don't like this at all. Oh my god, another cop! Holy smokes! You can't catch me, coppers! Never mind. <laughs> Dang it! Oh my god, that did not work as planned. Are you kidding me? Man. Well, I guess I'm just gonna enjoy the bed in prison today. Gosh darn it, game. <laughs> All right, well, you know what, guys? I think this is going to be the end of this episode for now. We are definitely starting to understand how the uh, hospital jobs work. Uh, I definitely can start doing the jobs without uh, the help of the bot. But sometimes, if you do that, apparently, these are the issues you can actually run into. Uh, I, I don't know. I really thought that I was supposed to give that guy some um, pain relievers, right? Because he had pain. Um, he had a broken bone. Of course, I had to give him something. But maybe I had to give him inflammatory stuff? I don't know. I guess we are about to learn more how to become a, a better doctor there without using the doctor's help, without using the machine. Because if you don't do that, you are actually getting a bonus amount of coin. And uh, you guys know that we want all the coins possible. All right. Anyway, guys, that being said, thank you all very much for watching. If you want to support the channel, a like would definitely be the way. Also, you can try to become a channel member if you want to by clicking on the join button on the links in the description. Uh, that would help me even grow the channel even more. Uh, it'll also give you guys some extra perks and uh, extra channel points you can use during my live streams. But that being said, guys, thank you very much for watching. Stay safe and I'll see you on the next one. Bye, everybody.